Okay, everybody, YouTube. Here's uh, some of the stuff I'm working on recently, and uh, I got some blades back from Heat Treat here. Right here, these are uh, four silverbacks. Um, two of them are going to be nitrited, the ones that are bead blasted. I still have to go back and uh, finish grind and get everything uh, to shape. The other two, uh, the two on the outside, those are just going to have the natural uh, scale finish on the back, and then uh, they'll be shaped up and stuff. This is about the point I take them uh, before heat treat and then uh, finish them when they come back. So over here we've got some more knives. Um, the bottom one right there is a, it's basically the profile of a competition chopper. Uh, it's in CPM 3V, actually all these blades are in 3V. And then right above it, that's a Sasquatch blank that's, uh, I'm just getting the fuller into, I haven't ground yet. Right above that is a Silverback 1.5, it's uh, much like Cliff Stamps knife. Um, with curvature, and then right above that one is another Silverback 1.5, but uh, with no curvature, and it's still pretty rough. Um, it's a PTK knife um, above that, and then uh, hold on a second. Let's get something to point with so that, and so here, here is the Here's the PTK knife. Um, still have to shape out the handle and everything, but the blade is pretty much to shape right now. Uh, this is a Wakasashi at a CPM M4 that is heat treated, ready to go. And then I have a large katana. This is a uh, 41 inch piece right here. It is um, got full bohe. I don't know if that's going to come in very well on the light and uh, that's out of CPM 3V like everything else this is an order uh, going to China it's also a CPM 3V katana uh, with a 28 inch blade right now so that's all those and then I have the last knife that's in here is the Super Assassin this is a Wakasashi right here but it's got a 20, got a 21 or 22 inch blade at 2 inches wide, so it's basically like a competition chopper geometry, but with a with a significant distal taper so that it's not unwieldy. Um, I'll uh, give you guys some progress as I get some things finished with these pieces, but just thought I would give everybody a look at some of the stuff I've got coming out of the shop in the near future. Alright, thanks for watching.